हेलो स्टूडेंट्स ऑन ट्वेल्थ यू आर गोइंग टू फेज क्लास टेंथ बोर्ड एग्जाम सो एज द क्वेश्चन पेपर ऑफ द बोर्ड एग्जाम इज ऑलवेज बेस्ड ऑन एनसीईआरटी सो देयर फोर फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल यू हैव टू कंप्लीट एंटायर सिलेबस फ्रॉम एनसीईआरटी टेक्स्ट बुक टू अंडरस्टैंड द कॉन्सेप्ट ऑफ ईच एंड एवरी चैप्टर एंड वाइल कंप्लीटिंग द चैप्टर इट इज माय एडवाइज इज टू write all the concept formulas and statement of theorems on a particular sheet uh, like a4 and the unit which carries more marks in the question paper you have to practice uh, you have to give more time to practice and after completing the entire syllabus from ncert textbook then you complete my minimum level uh, study material uh, for standard based exam which i have uh, uploaded in my website that is kumarsar34.wordpress.com and then after completing that you can go through any of the author like uh, adi sharma and rs agarwal because it gives a broader view of the questions to be asked in the paper moreover it pro it provides more questions to the students to do a uh, practice after completing all this revision work then you start solving the cbse sample paper for standard board exam and <clears throat> i always advise my students to start from section d that is of four marks questions after completing section d then section c that is of three marks questions and uh, section b two marks questions and lastly section a that is of one mark question and uh, you try to complete the whole paper in 2 uh, hours 45 minutes and uh, after solving sample paper cbse sample paper you attempt all my sample papers that is 10 sample papers and 10 sample paper test papers along with answer as a test uh, i have uploaded this uh, sample paper in my website the blog kumarsa34.wordpress.com and whenever you are uh, attempting this sample paper as test you fixed time for each sample paper as 2 hours 45 minutes and doing enough practice of this uh, sample papers it will boost your level of confidence and practicing the sample papers also teaches the concept of uh, time management to you i'm sure that this exercise will help you to complete your board exam in 2 and 1/2 hours and please always remember in uh, during the first 15 minutes the reading time you have to read the question paper with full concentration and uh, uh, all the question paper you mark all the question paper in which you feel uh, difficult so that you can attempt later and first of all you attempt those questions which you are sure about uh, starting from section d to a and understand the worth of each questions never spend too much time uh, that is 5 uh, to 10 minutes on a single question if you don't know the solution of a particular question leave some space for that question and continue uh, to the other question <coughs> always remember your answer should sheet should be neat and clean and whatever the rough work you are doing you try to do on the same page uh, by drawing a margin uh, do not cut the rough work because sometimes what will happen you forget to draw the diagram uh, on the main page on the main side and uh, that may be considered if you draw on the rough side that may be considered for partial mark also and you try to avoid over overwriting and always use pencil and scale to draw the figures never use a pen to draw any figure and because there is no negative questions don't leave any questions unattempted if you don't know the answers at least you write some formulas related to that questions and uh, you may get some half marks for that and never lose your patience during the exam if you do not know the answers to any questions do not lose your uh, patience you try uh, to complete all the questions which is familiar to you and then last you can attempt those questions okay so i wish you all the best children god bless you